Hello friends, welcome back to the channel. In the video series of the subject Introduction to Smart Grid, today I will discuss about the advantages, disadvantages and the challenges of smart meters. So without delay, let's start our discussion about the topic. Advantages of smart meters are both for the utilities and for consumers. So for the consumers, the biggest advantage of a smart meter is that the having their access of the data, the data is historical. Another data which they can access that is a real time data. So this data consists of energy cost, their demand and different other parameters also so the consumer can access their historical and the real-time data with the help of smart meters then the second advantage for the consumers are that, that the energy consumption data is continuously displayed on the smart meter so they can access they can watch that what is the real-time energy consumption and the consumption is high then they can reduce their demand as per the requirement or as per the situation. The next advantage of a smart meter is that the demand response technique can be implemented. If uh, the implementation of demand response, if multi-tariff functions are used, then the customer can follow the demand response technique. Then uh, another advantage, since smart meters are in the communication with the smart devices, so those smart devices can be controlled automatically. So this is an add-on feature in smart grid with the help of smart meters and smart devices. Then consumers can reduce the cost or they can reduce their energy consumption pattern by shifting their demand from higher demand period or higher tariff period to lower tariff period this can be done because they are having the access of a real-time data so on the basis of that data if the data is showing that this time charges are high and after two hours or four hours the charges will be low then consumer can shift their energy consumption pattern to the off peak tariff period then another advantage will be in the manual billing procedure the consumers are having different complaints that date the meter reading is not accurate or there are some errors in the meet uh, the energy bills so these problems can be avoided because these smart meters will provide more accurate and timely billing then Another advantage is that that improved outage restoration. Then further continuing to the advantages, next advantages are for the utilities. Then the utilities are having access to the quality data and it can influence the energy consumption of users because they are able to monitor the data continuously and accordingly they can plan their resources whatever they are having so they can change the energy consumption pattern of user by inf informing consumers that this is the lower uh, this is off peak period or peak period and in this way they can develop more competitive energy market because if there are more utility companies in the market then they can participate in the competitive energy market that uh, in this time period the energy charges are high suppose there are two or more uh, two companies are there two utility companies are there then at that time one company may provide the higher charges and another company may provide the lower charges because the load connected to another utility is low so they can offer electricity at lower rates so in this way the competitive energy market will be there then they can monitor the energy generation from renewable energy resources means they can 
continuously monitor the generation whether that is from the conventional power plant but generally renewable energy power generation or distributed generation are installed at the location of the consumer's end so with the help of smart meters they can monitor that renewable generation also they can support the demand response techniques since they are having the information on the tips so they can manage the grid efficiently better communication channel in the normal grid or with the help of normal meters the communication is only from the utility to consumers but with the help of a smart meter bidirectional communication is possible so this will form a better communication channel between utility and consumers since uh, utility companies are having access of data so lot of data is available with the utility companies this data uh, may be demand pattern power factor and any other type of data which can be recorded with the help of smart meters then utility can use that data they can analyze and then accurate load forecasting can be done with the help of that data so the improved for load forecasting then if they are having the better or accurate load forecasting then they can provide the better power supply to consumers by purchasing the power as per the requirement so better power procurement process this is the another advantage of uh, smart meters to the utility companies they can provide power quality in better condition means improved power, power quality power theft and metering uh, meter tampering can be detected uh, this is another advantage to utility because in general utility companies are having issues of power theft and meter tampering so smart meters can avoid this issue then obviously there are some disadvantages associated with the smart meters the first disadvantage is that the loss of data yeah uh, or risk of loss of privacy because the data is available in the smart meters utilities are having access of their data so, and this data is communicated through the network hen and when hen nen and when so the security of that that data is must and this detail of user use reveal information about user activities uh, if utility companies are having that data they are able to monitor that data then it will be clearly visible that the consumption of any house or any society in general we can say that for any particular house that consumption is low it means nobody is staying in that home so they can uh, or unwanted persons or unwanted elements can detect that in this house nobody is there so some intruder can come and then tap uh, probability of theft may increase so this is a one type of uh, risk of loss of privacy and in similar way there are several other possibilities of loss of data and the misuse of that data can be done then greater potential for monitoring by other or unauthorized third parties this uh, it is similar then potentially reduced reliability because the meters are more complicated the more uh, if the complications will be more then obviously this the intruder or outsider or a third party can access that data then increased security risk from network or remote access these are the some disadvantages of smart meters and challenges with the smart meters that some sections of society are unaware of the benefits of smart meters and they believe that a competitive market as a result of real time price will increase the electricity cost because the smart meters are having higher initial cost so it will be a great challenge to 
convince the consumers as well as the utility that smart meters are beneficial for both otherwise they both will say that the the east will increase the cost then some consumers are having uh, the concern about the data privacy this is another challenge then utilities have upgrade their infrastructure and improve their institutional framework because the complete infra existing infrastructure has to be replaced for installing smart meters in the existing system then lack of interaction between consumers and utilities because they are not uh, in frequent touch so this is another challenge then lack of standardization since uh, as there are no uh, regulatory body who is making standards for uh, installation of smart meters or who can make it compulsory to users and as well as to utilities that they the smart meters are must to be installed in the existing system if it will be must or it will be made compulsory by some regularization body then obviously they both will be bound to use smart meters then security of smart meters can be compromised this is an uh, issue with the smart meters these are the few challenges uh, in smart meters these are the references from which this content is being prepared thanks for watching the video for more updated video stay connected with the channel and for this you need to subscribe the channel so like this video subscribe the channel and share it thanks for watching